Okay guys, in this uh, instructional video, I'm going to show you how to um, change the um, video banner that's on the middle of your homepage, on your website. As you can see, I'm logged into my Test GZP Web Design WordPress site, and uh, this is the homepage. As you can see, there is a video of these two weird looking guys right in the middle of the page. Uh, you click on play and it'll play. Let me show you how to change the one that's on your site, or if there's not one on your site right now, how to add this to it. Uh, we're going to use a plugin called the Front Page Banner plugin. This plugin is already installed on your uh, on your website. All you need to do is go to it to use it. So you need to first of all log into your uh, dashboard. I've already logged into mine. Once you're logged in, you're going to need to scroll down to where you see FPB settings. Click on that to open the uh, FPB. Uh, the front page banner plugin settings page. The only area on this page you need to concern yourself with is the custom code area. This box is where you're going to paste your embed code of your video. Don't change anything else because that could cause a problem with your video. Alright, so in the custom code uh, box you're going to want to paste your YouTube uh, embed code in there. So I'm going to go to YouTube and going to get a random uh, video. This is the video that's up there currently that I just showed you. Uh, in order to get the embed code, you're going to go down to where it says share right under the video, and then you're going to go to embed. Okay, now you need to, this is important, you need to change. You need to select one of these options. You want to use the old embed code. So you'll see under here there's a bunch of different options. You're going to want to uh, uh, select use old embed code. You see how the embed code changed? You're going to need to use that. If you want to have your video autoplay, you need to use the old embed code. If you want to have your video automatically play once the website loads up. So I'm going to switch it to use the old embed code so I can show you how to have the video autoplay if you want to have that option. Uh, once you click on that, you're going to want to change the size of the video. Right now the video is 560 width by uh, 315 height. That's the custom size or the, the default size for all the YouTube videos. Your video needs to be 900 width uh, and the height will change automatically to 488 height. 900 is pretty much the standard um, size for any uh, WordPress um, website area standard uh, width of the uh, the word of the website area for pretty much WordPress or any HTML site if your site is a different size for whatever reason I'll send you some notations and tell you what particular size to set your video to but for the, for the most part 900 by uh, 488 is a perfect size it'll fit perfectly and snugly on the the, uh, the page so as you can see the uh, the width is 900 the height has changed to 488 going to select the embed code when you click on it once it selects the whole code you'll see it's all highlighted in blue I'm going to right click on that and click copy then you're going to go back to your front page banner plugin settings and you're going to paste the code right in the custom code box there you go the code is pasted in there and you just go down here click save changes and uh, I'll just refresh it and uh, there's the video the video is up there yeah, but as you can see, it's not auto-playing. Uh, if you don't want it to auto-play, you're all done. But if you do want the option to have the video play automatically when people come to your site, you need to add a tiny bit of code to your embed code. So we're going to go back to the front page plugin uh, settings page. And uh, you need to get a small bit of code that I sent to you in your uh, welcome email. Uh, the file should be um, labeled something like code editing info open that file up and you go down to where it says code to autoplay a YouTube movie the code is the section that's in red it's gonna say and autoplay equals one so you're gonna to want to copy that and then uh, go back to your custom code your custom code box area under your front page banner uh, plugin settings and you're gonna paste that code in a specific area the code needs to be pasted in the um, embed code Right after your YouTube video URL, you notice the URL because you'll see HTTP in the www.youtube.com. You want to paste the code right before the question mark. So put your cursor right before the question mark. Hold down Command on a Mac and press V to paste your code in there. It's Command on a Mac to paste and Control. I'm sorry, Command V on a Mac to paste the uh, auto the uh, code in there, and Control V to paste it on a PC. Um, so you got it in there right before the question mark. There's actually two instances of, that you need to put it in. Both times where you see your YouTube uh, 
video URL, you need to paste it in there. So there's one at the top. You scroll down a little bit further, and there is another one. Again, right before the question mark, put your cursor, hold down Command, press V to paste on a uh, Mac, or hold down Control and press V to paste uh, on a PC. So now you have the and autoplay equals one code in your embed code. You're going to click Save. And uh, we're going to go back to the page. We're going to refresh it, and you'll see the video will autoplay. There you have it. Video is playing. So that's it, guys. It's very simple to change this video. It's very simple to uh, implement this particular plugin. Um, if I went too fast, uh, I'm sorry. I've been drinking about four cups of coffee. But uh, hopefully, you know, you understood it. If not, just rewatch the video, and uh, it'll all make sense. It's very simple to, to do. All right. See you in the next video.